All right, that's right guys. What you're seeing here is flooded water. This is by far the craziest thing I've done. I'm breaking my car no rule. Remember guys, I told you if I don't, if it's 60% chance of rain, I won't do it. Right now we have about 80% up to 100% chance of rain. But you know what? I need to catch some flounder. I need to catch some trout. Regardless, we got some bad weather, man. I mean, nice. it's just what it is, man. But I'm going in. <laughs> oh god, the things I do to fish, man, seriously. Seriously, seriously. <laughs> nice, just trolling, I got something on. <laughs> nice, a little trout on the Yozuri. <laughs> trolling it behind me, man. Thank you, dude. Appreciate it. Bye. All right, ladies and gents, we are back now with clear asylum. So not much happened. <laughs> I just went around this whole back marsh, I guess, all the way around and not even one single bite. And now I'm using the clickbait, see if we can get something to tag me. I might go back to the Yoziri. Oh, nice, I just got smacked there. Okay, that's promising. Had a nice little thump there. Another small little guy and I just hit it. He spit it out though. There we go. There we go. Got him. Oh, he's a decent size spec. Oh, dude. Wow. Holy smoke. Oh, dude. Oh, come on, Nick. Don't be an idiot. <laughs> he's a decent. Yeah, he's a decent size spec. He's probably going to be about 18 incher. Woo. Wow. I caught him like right at that grass line into this thing and he is pulling some drag folks and put him in the net but that's a nice little trout there i guess we're gonna eat good tonight boy <laughs> all right don't move okay you slippery oh well 20 inches on the dot with that one buck tooth freaking vampire teeth man but 20 inches man decent freaking respectable trout it's been a grind man i thought it was going to be on fire except it wasn't on fire but we're gonna keep on trying, all right, man? At least I got food. Oh, there we go. Oh, there's a red. There's a red. <laughs> he hit it right at the boat. Wow, on the Yozuri, baby. That's gotta be a slot, the way he's pulling. And he chased it all the way. Beautiful. Just out of reference, man. He is six pounds. Six pound redfish. Very thick. Very nice. 22 and three quarters. I thought he's going to be a 24 incher. I lied. I lied. He's just a big, fat, heavy dude. All right, buddy. You ready to go? Oh, shoot. You are ready to go. Dang it. <laughs> hey, man. I can't ask for a better way to freaking come out in the middle of a storm and uh, we just got maybe an hour before the next storm comes and hits us and I'm able to catch on a nice trout a nice redfish to me that's a great day man great day great day there we go there we go nice and then a smaller redfish or trout oh flounder I got my slam bro <laughs> oh my gosh on the Yoziri man can you believe that the Yoziri picks up everything holy smoke oh yeah 
Dude, this day turned out pretty darn good. Uh, we are 16 and three quarters. Yep, you're illegal, so we will keep you because you are bleeding to death. And uh, <laughs> we'll enjoy eating you, man, that's for sure. God. Man, it was a rough day. The weather was not cooperative. I got freaking drenched. But uh, the fishing was good, I can't complain. So I need to lay these fishes up real fast so we can do the catch and cook. All right, fellas, man, I have a dilemma, man. My youngest son, Joseph, he does not like fish at all. And it, it bothers me so much because fishing is my life. I have a YouTube fishing channel. So what I'm gonna do today is I'm gonna cook these fish that I caught, especially a speckled trout. I'm gonna cook it in a way that it's gonna be so delicious, he can't say no. All right, the plan is simple, man. I'm gonna cook this fish in an Asian style dish. It's gonna be so tasty, so good. Like I said, he ain't gonna say no. This is the ingredients that we're gonna use. We got Chinese broccoli, we got cabbage, we got mushrooms, we got cilantro, we got flat Asian noodles, we got the oyster sauce, and last but not least, we, we, got, we got the frozen fish, the trout. First things first, so we need to cut up the vegetables. Just got done with the Chinese broccoli. I don't really like the stems, I don't know about you guys, but if you want to use these, by all means, man, throw it in there, but I don't like eating these. It tastes like bamboo. Next step is now to boil the noodles, the flat noodles, the Chinese noodles. All right, now it's time to make the secret sauce from Amsterdam. I mean, Thailand, the, the oyster sauce. Check it out guys, this is garlic and sesame seed. You can buy this all at the store. You don't have to do this at home at all. That's what I did. Don't you think I'm getting good at filleting? <laughs> hey Toby, you want some fish boy? You want some speckled trout? Huh boy, you want some speckled trout? Alright ladies and gents man, I got the fish frying. I got my veggies all cut up. It's gonna be delicious. Now I need to do one more thing. I gotta stir fry all of them. So let me walk this way. And look what I got. A walk. Walk this way. All right, man. So first things first, you want to turn this on, get this heat up. Now I'm going to throw the veggies inside here. The secret sauce. Right there, boys. Check it out. That's Panda Express quality, man. All right, ladies and gents, I got the wok simmering really, really nice. Now it's time to add the flat noodles, man. You need your carbs, man. All right, ladies and gents, the most important part of this meal, obviously, is gonna be your protein. And what do you think about my filleting skills, huh? I think I'm improving. They just go dump it in here like this. Blah. And we're just gonna mix it in really nice. So we got fish pieces, we got noodles, and we got your vegetables. This is gonna be delicious, man. I'm telling you, if my son doesn't eat this, then I don't know what to tell you, man. This tastes better than pepperoni pizza. 
there you have it gentlemen the final final recipe man check that out don't you think it turned out pretty good now i got a taste test of course so make sure he doesn't die all right man bottoms up I'm gonna get some noodles I'm gonna get some veggies here I'm gonna get the fish Yeah, not bad. And I told you earlier before, my son does not like fish, but I think he's going to love this dish because this dish tastes so savory, so tasty, so delicious. He's not even going to know it's fish. And if he doesn't like the fish, then I got my belt to, to keep my pants up. All right, guys, man, moment of truth. This is my youngest son, Joseph. Say hello, Joseph. Hi. So Joseph, I made you a dish. This is uh, noodles with a little bit of vegetables and chicken. Go ahead and try it out. Tell me what you think. Make, sure, make sure you eat that, eat that piece of white meat right there. It's fish. No, it's, no, it's chicken. Eat it. <laughs> no, it's fish. It's chicken. You better eat like it. This. Just try it with the noodles. Stop complaining. I worked so hard for you. The noodles, the noodles is good. All right, now try that meat. The white piece of chicken there. I cooked it really good. Try it out. Just try it. And eat it with the noodles. What do you think? It tastes like nothing. Tastes like nothing? So that's a win, right? No. There you have it, guys. Great, great success. My boy loves it. He said it tastes like nothing, man. I'm telling you, it was really, really good. You saw it on the video evidence. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, make sure you hit that like button. Also, leave me a comment. Tell me what you think about this Catch and Cook and what you think about my youngest son. And most of all, please, please subscribe. Help the channel grow. And thank you guys so much. I love every single one of y'all. And I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace out.